Hey y'all, so it is surgery day. Happy surgery day, I guess. Um, I am all packed, ready to go. I'm gonna put my hair in a little pony thing back here. And I've took my bath, well I've took my shower, um, my second shower. And I think I scrubbed really, really well um, because I don't want to catch an infection. And um, I don't know why I am sweating this morning. Um, I guess it's my nerves. Got my fans blowing too on and I'm still sweating. Um, the doctor said that I would immediately be put into a surgical induced um menopause and so that my body will be going through some things after this and it immediately happens um right at surgery like i go right into menopause so i'm not looking forward to that i hope it's not as bad as everybody say but he says that um i'm going to be taking medicine every day for that so it should help um, with the menopause, um, and yeah, I'm, I'm ready. We're going to get ready to go here in about 15 to 20 minutes, probably about 20 minutes, um, and head that way. That way we are where we're supposed to be, um, not running late or anything like that. I did pack my... Um, what is this thing? Um, uh, computer. Um, I'm packing my camera. I have my phone for backup, you know, just so I can make sure I get, um, things for you guys. I've got my crossword puzzle. Oh, no, my word find puzzle that my daughter, my baby daughter got me. And I have my planner. You know, just a few things. And I also put my robe in here that I didn't show you guys unpack my bag. But um, you know, it'd be cold in there and I don't I don't want to be cold. So I got this and I did add my brush, like I said. Um I have my charger and my panties and bra is in here as well. And so I'm going to zip her up because she's all ready to go. My computer. So here she is. Um, yeah, so I'll see you guys at the hospital. I hope the wounds are nice. Um, I hope the wounds are nice. Yeah, hopefully. That's the big day. Say hello, she did. I guess I need to say hello. Hello. Today I feel like it's such a pass. And walking and talking. And my beautiful baby. Going in for surgery. No, I think they're going to be nice. Hopefully. Oh, I'm going to be out here for a couple days. Then I'll be in there. Well, at least when you come back out, well, it'll still be summertime. <laughs> yeah. Well, nerves. There's people inside, so let's go. But we didn't get no masks. They said they say you're supposed to have them. Yeah. Pretty sure they'll have one in there. If not, I think I got my other pack right there. Gotta go to the front desk. Mm hmm So.
Yeah. I'm going to get a visitor band for you. All right. I just need to ask in the last 24 hours if anyone's had a fever or flu-like symptoms. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> With this pink visitor band, it's something that we do every day when you come to visit, but you can come and go. So if you need to run errands, go to the car, anything you can do that, just show us your band on the way in. All right. Uh, surgery is, Erica's gonna be on the second floor, hon. This little cream color cap will take you to the elevators. When you get off on the second floor, just make a right down to registration. Okay. We do have a coffee shop in the cafeteria. Cool, oh, that's why I was like, hey, I gotta get me a... Uh, <laughs> Something for Britain. Okay. Cool. So you said there's a cafeteria or just a cafe? You said it's a cafeteria or just a cafe? Well, it's a cafeteria. Okay. Yeah, it's just short. They just have a waterfall cafe is that out here. Okay. But they have Felix's on the grill. He's awesome. Uh, I know, that's uh, hard to hear. You're good. Uh, you haven't had nothing to eat. What no. are my going on? That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> right. Thank you. It does warm the soul. That's the one I can have coffee. I want to see you come and get something down here. Well, the Starbucks sign right there, too. Do you remember what they said, Connie? She said elevator, second floor. So, right here. Nerves. Yeah, I'm funny. <laughs> oh. I'm gonna be over. <laughs> so surgery is this way. Baby. Surgery says surgery is this way. Labor and delivery, right? <laughs> yeah. Wrong time. Where are I going? Baby, right through here. Yeah. It says through here. So probably right there. I am in here guys getting ready so I look a hot mess but um I guess this is where they're gonna get me hooked up and I wait here before I go to surgery <sighs> I'm getting off here and, <laughs> and then when he walked out, I heard Dr. B tell me that, oh no, he's definitely getting blood like y'all. So, um, I just don't know. He said it's either going to be before they start or right after. If I'm okay while they're doing it, don't get to me right after, so it'll be funny. Mm. Don't get scared now. <laughs> we're going we're gonna to fight through this and beat it.
eight something. I'll find out. Tell everybody hello. And the journey continues. Well, I'm pretty sure a lot of people are saying prayers and hopefully they get this first bit out and we're going to take the next dirt, uh, hurdle on the second one later because they're doing tumor and all today they're getting tumor out and cutting the other cancer out so everything just everything looks good. I don't know no fevers, everything, you know, I tolerate the blood, all that, all that stuff. I don't know. I see you focusing on that key getting out of here on Sunday night. Are you on the fire? I'm 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 not for that. I'm gonna try to make sure we can And pretty soon you'll be back to your normal self terrorizing the house and um, <laughs> On your cleaning missions so hopefully you'll have a little bit more energy from that and the other one doesn't take it out of you yeah. love you but we're signing off for now let her get her some uh some uh q a time Hey, what does everybody know? It's my wife walking. First time she's been able to take a step in the past 15 hours. Hmm. She's got it going. She's moving. On her own. <laughs> well, with a walker, of course. But she's doing it. I'm surprised after having your stomach split open. surgery and I'm here in my room trying to recover um feeling okay like my throat sore my throat is sore from that anesthesia stuff but um yeah I'm just sitting here looking out my hospital room guys and thanking God that I made it through this surgery I'm sore feeling like I've been hit by a max truck but I'm blessed to be here um I just wanted to turn the camera on and talk to you guys for a few minutes I suppose had ate my breakfast. Let me show you guys. Yuck. 
it had bacon, but ugh. My pretty flowers are over there. Hubby slept right here. And he's coming in, y'all. He coming in. Say hey, boo. Hello, world. Don't mind me. Thank you, baby. They had stop an apple. Your snapple is served, ma'am. Thank you. Got a straw here too, if you need it. Yeah, a straw would be good. Mm -hmm. And your straw. Oh, y'all, that's better. I was trying to drink. Um, I was trying to drink the orange juice. Their orange juice was nasty. No offense, but it wasn't good. This is it, boo. You a poet? Throw it, boy. I spill it on my stove. Is that one on the end? Yeah. It was not, unless it watered down fast. It probably did, but the ice doesn't hold up well, so I can't just snap a rattle. No, I'm going to drink this. <clears throat> you get you something to eat? No, I got, well, I got uh, tater tots. Because the burgers, I don't even know how them kids and, and mom ate it yesterday when I bought it for them. That was horrible. It was I nasty. took a bite in this, like, cardboard. You know how those soy burgers used to taste? Oh, that's probably what it was. Yeah, I'm like, uh, give me my five dollars back. Thank you. But he had some chicken that looked good in there. They were doing a combo thing for six fifty with some macaroni and cheese that looked good on this end, where it's already been picked off of. But the other end, I'm like, dude, is that uh, marshmallows on top of, of macaroni and cheese? Um, it's like dirty, sour, dirty, dirty version <laughs> with no seasoning at a restaurant. So of course, yeah, I didn't why try is it like that? Why is hospital food? food? Like that. I ain't gonna lie, if you look at it though, like like they got pizzas and um of course I just I couldn't fathom the pizza right now, but I was looking at that chicken. No, I, I would have like, ate pizza. I should have asked me if I could have got that chicken on the salad and been done. But I, I thought you said you was going to get some. That's what I was going for, but they didn't have the salad sign on. Only thing they actually says this area closed and then over there the only thing they had was the grill. And I was just like, uh. Well, y'all, hubby gonna eat his, whatever he got over there. And I'm gonna drink my stop of apple. And um, I was editing for you guys. I'm pretty bored. I didn't have anything else. I wasn't doing anything else, so. Um, yeah, hop back off. I'll be back soon, guys. Um, the next time you see me, I'll probably be leaving here or already at home. Um, and thanks again for you guys' support. And see you soon. We'll talk to you guys soon. Made it home. And there's not much a girl can say right now. I'm so woo woo woo.
I don't know. I'll probably be mumbling. But I made it in. Got my medicines here. Um, and now it's time for recovery. So, I love you guys. And I hope you catch up with me in the next video.